Hey guys, welcome back to the Good Enough Guy Crafts with Mr. Shannon. I just want to share with y'all the latest project. We have built this arbor slash trellis so the wife can plant some vining plants along the bottom and grow up the sides. And these 4x4 posts are 3 feet in the ground so this thing is sturdy as hell built it so we can walk through it with no problem we're going to grow the plants on the outside and all the way above on top i had to build this in about two segments i spent one day working on the uh, wooden frame and then this afternoon i put up the wiring uh, it should work really well for our purposes so let me take you through here. We have also been growing some dragon fruit. And here are three dragon fruit planters that we've put up at different times. This first one here is our very, very first one. You'll notice it is sitting above the ground. We got four plants in there. And it is very, very happy where it is sitting. Here we go. That's natural mystic variety. All four? Mm -hmm. All right, so apparently uh, this one is natural mystic variety, all four segments. Red and fruit with red flesh. Red fruit with red flesh. And what's what are these guys? Um, this one is Bruni. This is a Vietnamese Jaina and Thai red. And what do we got on the third one, these uh, little babies? This is all Thai red babies. Thai red babies. So these ones I actually put down at ground level uh, the first one was an experiment i do wish i had put it into the ground so that way the roots can go deeper but whatever apparently this is the way you grow these bad boys and we're hoping in springtime we get some fruit uh, we do build these here at the good enough guy crafts channel and uh, sell them locally and sometimes we'll throw in a uh, free cutting with it so if you live in the Fort Myers, Naples area, let us know if you're interested in something like this. Hey, where do we learn how to grow this stuff? Grafting Dragon Fruit on YouTube. Apparently, we're learning how to do this from a guy named Grafting Dragon Fruit on YouTube. And we are going to post a link for his stuff because without him, we would not have figured this out. Guys, thanks for watching and enjoy your day.